Welcome to this mod pick overview. So we have here all the mods and they are categorized into different categories. So if you like a certain category, just click through it. Without further waiting, let's start. So let's start with create. The main mod is create. So as you can see, we have a lot of mechanical machines that are helpful for automation and you can use them to, yeah, well, use them as a helper. You can see here all the contents. And there are quite a bit. So yeah, that's the main mod actually in this mod pack. The next mod is create chunk loading. It adds a block that is the chunk loader. If you're away, this block can load the chunk you probably want to use. The next mod is create live 3 add-on. This one adds new recipes, ingots, cockwheels and powders etc. Here are some of the blocks. Create alloy adds these two metals. So basically we have now steel and bronze. Create steam powered adds now steam powered engines. So we have now steam style blocks, engines, flywheels, cogwheels. So it's quite cool to use it with create. The last one in this category is create tweaker. So if you know craft tweaker, this is the same one for create. You basically can change recipes, add commands, scripting, comments and item properties. The next category is furniture decorations and building blocks. So everything that you can use to build your house. The first mod in here is create deco. So basically you can use now decorative blocks for create. Here are some of them that are quite cool. The next mod in here is Macaws Bridges. So now some bridges can be used to cross over lakes or something different. There are also some stairs here. The last mod in this category is Storage Drawers. Now you can have drawers where you can put your items in. You can sort very easily with this mod your different items and treasures. When it comes to the overworld change, Terralith helps with that. So basically it's an overworld expansion which adds tons of new biomes and caves. It's very beautiful to explore and quite colorful actually. So check it out. So let's look into equipment. Building gadget gives you these two devices. It's the egg changing gadget and the building gadget. Both of them are very helpful if you have bigger projects. The gravestone mod adds a gravestone when you died. So instead of your loot falling all over the place, well this one adds the gravestone when you died. Journey map adds a map. On to the right corner of the my screen you can see map and as well if you press down M you can see the whole map that you explored. Nature's compass adds a compass with which you can find different biomes. Just look over here and start your search. The last mod in this category is sophisticated backpacks. There are a variety of different backpacks that you can put down on the floor as well. Very helpful actually if your item inventory is full. There's only one mod that is added when it comes to food in this mod pack. Pharmacy Light adds a lot of different ways to cook. So you can put down a pan now and cook your food in a pan and then you actually have to cut it. It adds also new cooking recipes and different ways of cooking. So enjoy it! The last category is Game Changer Miscellaneous, so everything that doesn't fit into the other categories. With Apple Skin you can see the value of your items. So you can now see how much an item can give you. Clumps helps with XP. So instead of having hundreds of XP orbs, you only have one big one. They clump together if they're nearby. Configured lets you edit mods, so it's very helpful for like server admins. Craft Tweaker lets you change recipes, add commands, add scripts or comments, items and properties. Emotiful lets you add some emotes. You can go down here and add a smiley. Woohoo! Fancy menu for Forge lets you configure the menu screens with animations. Fast leaf decay lets the leaf decay faster after chopping. Wow! Flywheel is a modern rendering engine for modded Minecraft. So probably no one of you gonna use it. FTP chunks, ranks, teams and quests is added into this mod pack. It basically lets you claim chunks, it has a ranking system, 
and the team progression and as well team based questing. GEI and GEI Tweaker are also in here. With GEI you can see basically recipes and it's also easy to use when you're in creative. GEI Tweaker lets you hide items, hide categories and is basically an add-on for GEI. Light Overlay for Rift Forge and Fabric Basically this mod does an NEI like light level overlay and basically shows you what light level a block has. Mouse tweaks enhances the mouse buttons and inventory management. It's quite cool to drag and drop. Quark is a compilation of small things. Most of them are changing the world. So basically cave upgrade, new redstone, building blocks, stalactites, stalagmites, new mobs and tons of new functions. Very very helpful. Shut up experimental settings. So basically if you want to create a world, very often you will figure out that this one comes up. So this mod does actually remove that. The one probe. With the one probe you get more information, like Euler. So if you knew it, the one probe gives you information about a block or more. So if you know Weiler, this one is basically the same but with an item. So this would be everything in this mod pack. Leave a like or subscribe or comment if you like this mod pack or if you like mods in general. See ya!